Ooh, pretty. Those are some big words. Okay, side profile. I see what you did there, however. It's so smooth. Some big words, smart man. friends and gamers. I almost entirely missed this video because I was doing other stuff. Uh, also, this could go horribly wrong. My CPU is being weird. Anyway, we're watching a character teaser. I, I should have seen this coming. I know the update is next week because it's the same day I go back to school for the semester. Lovely timing. I know. I realized this last night. Uh, we have a Hatham's character teaser, which I should be more excited, but my brain is so out of it. It's 10 o'clock. I, I don't know why I wasn't prepared for this. Okay. Character teaser for all Hatham. Questions and silence. Okay, it seems a bit on the short side. Down here it says it's 1 minute 32 seconds, which seems a bit on the short side for a character teaser, especially for a five star. But we'll see. I have no thoughts. My brain is empty. Uh, let's just watch it and maybe then I will have thoughts because uh, the brain is not braining right now. Helioverse, what do you got for me? What do you got, Helioverse? Ooh, pretty. The origins of Hryphen. Ooh, also, time. my subtitles got messy. Oh, it's because I reset my PC. That would be the reason, isn't it? Yeah. Like, why are my subtitles not the right size that I like to keep them at? It's because I reset my Windows. Yep, that would that would be the reason. That's a whole other story. Okay, let's look back to the flowers. It's so the pretty. I love the sunflowers. Also, is this really loud or is it just me? Investigate the genesis of language. Those are some big words, I'll hate them. Ooh, it's so smooth. And the little sparklies. The little sparklies. The symbols? You mean letters? The skies. Oh. <gasps> How pretty is that? It's really pretty. And the birds. Oh. Okay, side profile. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, for peace. Oh, that's adorable. Oh, it's so smooth. Walks of life. Oh. When you can't tell if it's uh, Dinyar Zod or just a random NPC in the background. History made an archive for oh my God, the music. Oh my God. And he's like zooming through history. Wow, that's fun. That's, a, I see what you did there, however. I see what you did there. Only the truth, but the questions it leaves unanswered. Why does this look like the login screen? Oh no, it's the sunflowers again. It's like, why does this look like the login screen? Is this a Celestia check? Oh no, it's raining now. The profound is the Ooh, it's so smooth! Only with a boundless and oh, how science. pretty. I'm not even paying attention to his words. Those are some big words, smart man. I'm just like, oh, you're so pretty. Oh, that was really short. Is that the end? Yeah, I guess so. Yeah, no, that's it. That was really short. It was a lot. Very cinematic from him. It was definitely really cinematic. Like, I feel like that's the most cinematic one we've gotten. Well, not the most cinematic. We've definitely gotten more cinematic ones. But it's so smooth and pretty. I'm like, is that because I reset my PC so my graphics drivers are working a little bit better? Or is it just like smoother? I can't really tell, but it's so nice. I want to end on this shot. Oh no, not that one. This one. Oh, and he's this smile. Oh, that's so cute. And they have little Nahida in the background. That's so cute. I like it. I like it a lot. I still feel like for whatever reason, for as long as I've been excited for playable Alhatham, I'm more excited for Yao Yao's release. Maybe it's because she's the four star and I know I'm gonna have to spend money to get Alhatham because I haven't been playing that much. Who knows? Maybe that's maybe it's because I know I'm gonna have to spend money. Cause I the 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 holiday money I have is being spent on Ayaka's outfit for sure. So I just gotta hope I get lucky on the uh the polls here. I feel like I don't really have anything to say. Very pretty very cinematic i feel like the animation quality is really nice and i also really love when they do this almost like flat paper cut style art in character trailers and things like that i guess in this case it'd be more so like storybook art and i really like that I really like the style of art so i'm happy to see it i feel like i really don't have much to say for him we do have some gifts and of the talents and stuff we can go into so i have to go pop over to twitter for that which i'm never excited to do look at this video a like though it was pretty where's the twitter link Hold on, I gotta set this up. Okay, this is the giveaway from this morning. Okay, we have talent number one, universality. You know, no, no, that's not how that word is read. Universality. Universality? Is that how that word is? We're gonna move on. An elaboration on form. Rushes forward, dealing dendro damage to nearby opponents when the rush ends, causing a chisel light mirror to form. So where's the light mirror? Oh my god, wait, it's a video? Not a gif? Is there sound then? Oh no, there's no sound. Darn! I was like, can we get like a, a voice line? Because I feel like his attacks with the light mirrors look like they'd make a fun little noise. And I love a fun little noise. So I'm like, can I can I hear the fun little noise? Can I hear it? 
I feel like they usually post gifts though, but now it's a video. What's up with that? Because it's not even like there's a ton going on in the clip that it wouldn't fit in a GIF or the GIF looked like really crispy. It's like just a, a video. I'm trying to point like pinpoint the light mirrors, but I can't seem to really get them. Is that just me? Oh, that means we can make it full screen though. It's going to be crispy, but we can make it full screen. Hey, <laughs> I guess those are the light. Oh yeah, the, I guess the little chisel light mirrors would be the little these things. So they just stack. Okay, that's cool. That's pretty cool. And then we have this one. The second talent is the particular field. Fetters of Phenomena. Creates a particular binding field and deals multiple instances of AoE dendro damage. Thank God. So this is, yeah, okay. So I guess those were the little chisels. So they stack for the ult. Maybe, I have no idea. Definitely gonna have to be something I figure out when the game actually updates. And I think most people will have to figure it out then, I guess. Definitely cool. It's a little bit, a little, little it's tame, but he's a very tame person, so I see. I feel like his, his lines were probably really nice. I, that's why I was kind of hoping we'd have sound, because then we'd be able to see the, the or he, hear, not, we can see it perfectly fine, but we'd be able to hear what he says for this part, but obviously not today. Darn. Wait, what's on the, what's on the Hollyverse website? Hold on. Did they just post the pictures here? Wait a minute. Okay, that's weird. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. <laughs> He's sitting. That's so cute. Oh, my God. All right. Sorry to zoom in on this, don't I? Okay, this is doable. I feel like that's too close. We got too close. Hold on. That's fine. Admonishing instruction. Ooh. The current scribe of the Sumer Academia, a man endowed with extraordinary intelligence and talent. He lives free from the searching eyes of ordinary people. Okay. Uh, my mouse is so busted. I, As you can see, every time I scroll downwards, it goes up. Fun. I still haven't gotten a new one. February 11th birthday. A dendro DPS character who uses chisel light mirrors in combat. Okay. While the chisel light mirrors persist, Alhatham will obtain a dendro infusion. When it's attacks at opponents, the light mirrors will unleash a coordinated attack, dealing AoE dendro damage. His burst creates a particular binding field that deals multiple instances of AoE dendro damage. I feel like, because they don't say main DPS, I feel like he could be either main or sub DPS, which definitely opens it up to more team comps. Ascension materials. Okay, so he uses Skarmouche drops. Oh, that's a new thing. Oh no, that's gonna be the sandworm. Oh dear. Oh no. If that's anything like the Punishing Girl Raven sandworm, I am not excited. Normal attack, up to five rapid strikes. I've never seen all this. Is this where they just posted a link? They're like, eh, go find out the info yourself. I like this though. Less time on Twitter is always good. I, I, here we go with the Adobe updates. I always get the Adobe update notifications and uh, I stopped getting them. Uh, and then I reset my PC and it's like, hey, update me. No, I'm not updating you. Okay. Charged consumes a certain amount of stamina to unleash two rapid storage strikes. Okay. So those are the talent gifts. It does say more about the light mirrors, but I'm just gonna peace out on that. Oh my God. Can I actually scroll on the page? Oh my God. My silly little mouse. Oh, wait a minute. So if you hold on this. Oh yeah, I guess that would be a hold. Yeah. So... If you hold the attack, you enter aiming mode to adjust the direction of Al Alhatham's rush attack. I like that because I am, I was going to say I'm a DPS, no, uh, Creative Cloud is updating. Thank you. I was going to say I'm an FPS gamer at heart. I'm not. I 200% am not. Um, I just played Overwatch for a really long time. Anyways, we're not talking about Overwatch. I hate Overwatch now. Okay. Ooh, a story. Capable person who keeps a low profile. A brilliant man, but he is only an ordinary employee of the academia with a stable job and a cushy house in Sumeru, leading a carefree and comfortable life. Yeah, that was kind of the whole bit with him during the Archon quest. Couldn't be more satisfied with how things are. I like that. You know, sometimes a job is just a means to an end. It's not, there's a work to live, don't live to work. Is that it? Yeah. It's like he lives, he works to support his lifestyle and nothing more than that. And he's okay with that. Sometimes that's all a job has to be, truly. When the sun is out, he says this weather is perfect for doing nothing at all. I love that. I love that. His roommate. <laughs> Look at him here. Look at him. He likes reading difficult and obtruse books and seeing others scratch their head in confusion. That's kind of fun. All right. I'll be taking some time for myself now. Goodbye. He just walks away. Look at him. The side eye from Chibi <laughs> Oh, that's pretty good. That's fun. That's really fun. Okay, we can end here now. This sounds fun. He's a fun dude. He's just some dude. Really, he really is. Smart dude. I will be pulling for him. Maybe I'll regret that. Who knows? Actually, I need I need more dendro. I have one. Like, realistically, I have one dendro character. And then my, I have my traveler. I haven't lost a 50-50 yet. I wasn't even supposed to pull between Wanderer and Alhatham. But I did. And uh, I, I got the character. But now I still got to win a 50-50. So this should be fun. 
I feel like I'm at a place though where even though as much as I like I'll hate them as a character in game and lore wise and like design and everything I feel like if I lose my 50 50 on his banner I don't think I'm gonna push really hard to try and get if I know that sounds bad I know that sounds bad but maybe I'll change my mind once I actually get to trial him and like with his demo that comes out in a couple of days Maybe I'll change my mind. But like, he's like at a level where I'm like, I do really want him as a character, kind of like Yai Miko, but I won't be upset if I don't get him sort of thing. Does that make sense? It's not like a, I must pull for this character and I need to get this character. I feel don't feel that draw in, but maybe like doing his story quests and things like that will change my mind on that. I don't know. I think it's going to come down to how much I enjoy his playstyle to be like, how much am I driven to spend money on this silly little banner? because he is releasing the same time as Ayaka's outfit, and I kind of want her outfit a little bit more because I've been building her lately and I really like playing her. I don't know though, we'll see. I feel like it's like, I still am gonna pull for him for sure and like throw all my primos into his banner, but we'll see what happens. Especially if I lose my 50-50 to Tignari, I don't think I would go super crazy to try and get him after that. I don't know. I don't know. Really up in the air on this one, truly. Probably sounds like sacrilegious coming from me because this is like one of the characters that I've been pining over for months now, but I don't know. We'll see. Anyways, that is it for this video. Thank you guys for watching. I will link the character teaser in the Hoyaverse page down below because it's so much easier than linking a bunch of tweets. And also you get so much more information from the Hoyaverse page. I like this change. Keep Let's keep doing this in 2023. Thank you. Less time on Twitter, the better. If you like this video, make sure to give me a like down below as well as subscribe for more and click the little notification bell to be notified when I upload new ones. As always, I hope everyone had her is having a super lovely day wherever you are in the world. I'm gonna go edit this video and I will see you all in my next one. Bye guys!